The Housing Development Corporation has moved in and evicted several people illegally occupying HDC houses in San Fernando. The eviction took place today in a number of areas in the southern city. Speaking at an HDC tree planting initiative today, Minister of Housing Edmund Dillon said the HDC is sending a strong message to those who are bent on breaking the law. Cameraman Che Tika Singh visited one of the eviction exercises and Mahalia Joseph Wharton has more in this report. Housing Minister Edmund Dillon said he would not tolerate anyone moving into HDC houses without the necessary approval. And there seems to be a pattern of persons when they see a, a vacant house, believing it to be empty. Sometimes they, those houses have been allocated and for some reason the occupants choose not to occupy it at that point in time. And therefore we will ensure that those who do so will be treated will face the full brunt of the law because in our exercises we are accompanied by members of the Labor Police Service who I believe will do the necessary in terms of charges and individuals for occupying these houses illegally. But the eviction exercise will continue throughout the length and breadth of Trinidad and Tobago. When TTT News visited one of the HDC developments where the exercise was being conducted, we spoke with Marsha Richards, a mother of five who said she and her husband were paying rent to a family member to stay at one of the houses. She said they've been there since March 2018. Um, our brother, my brother-in-law, which is my husband's brother, he told us, well, um, it's have a place that is empty. We could come and stay in it, but he, he said he has rights to the place and every day we'll just pay him a little rent and could stay in the place. So that's how we came here. Well, AGC came and they told us where we were staying here illegally and we had to move, but we had no idea about what that meant until they well, explained to us and told us we could be charged and um, they gave us a notice to leave for a week. She said they received the notice of eviction one month after moving into the home but could not leave as she had nowhere else to go. If given the chance, her husband Augustus Terence said they are willing to pay for their own home. Yes, I'm, I'm willing that if AGC could um, supply us with a house, which we don't have our reference number, I'm willing to pay the rent for the house. But Minister Dillon said those desirous of obtaining an HDC home must follow the correct procedure. We're not encouraging at all. We can't correct a, an illegal, illegality so by correct. No, no, no. You have to move out and apply to the normal chain because you're occupying it illegally. So we can't correct that by allowing you to stay in the premises. We won't allow that. And to those who aren't paying their mortgage, the minister said notices are issued. But if occupants fail to adhere to the notice, they too would be evicted. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TTT News.